Tantor Audio, a division of recorded books, presents Irresistible by Mary Balog, narrated by Rosalind Landor. Chapter One There was always a sense of pleasurable anticipation attached to entering London, even though one had to travel through the poorer, more crowded outer areas before reaching Mayfair and its splendid mansions and thoroughfares. There was an indefinable air of energy about the city, and the promise it gave of busy, varied activities to fill every hour of every day of one's stay. It was even more exhilarating to be arriving at the very beginning of the spring season, when all the beau monde would be converging on the city, supposedly so that their menfolk might take their seats in one of the two houses and conduct the nation's business. But that was only a small part of the reason— an excuse, if one would, for the general exodus from country estates and smaller popular centres and spas. Members of the Ton came to London during the spring to enjoy themselves, and enjoy themselves they did, with a dizzying array of balls and soirees and concerts and Venetian breakfasts and garden parties, not to mention attendance at theatres and pleasure gardens and walks and rides in fashionable Hyde Park, or excursions to see the sights, like the Tower of London, or simply to shop on Bond Street or Oxford Street. It was a special bonus, perhaps, to be arriving on a sunny spring day. The journey from Yorkshire had been a long and tedious one, and much of it had been accomplished in dull, cloudy weather, with even the occasional rain shower to slow their progress. Mud on the roads was always to be respected— even when one was eager to end a long journey. But although the morning had been cloudy, the sky cleared off during the afternoon, and the sun beamed down. Is this really it?